How do you make a motor? Well, we're gonna make a motor today, and for this, we're gonna need a metal coat hanger, some scissors, some electrical wire, about a meter and a half should do, some garden wire, an AA battery, some electrical tape, a paper clip, and a really strong magnet. So we're just going to build the frame for our motor firstly. So we've got our metal coat hanger and we just bend that around like that. Take our electrical wire and we want to wrap this around the hook of our coat hanger but with just a little bit hanging down so like this. So if I just wrap it round few times just like that we can just chop this wire about 60 centimeters down so just chop it off we then need to create another little bit of wire about the 40 about 40 centimeters long like that but you also need a little bit of garden wire and I like to use garden wire because it's, it's a little bit stiffer than your electrical wire. So we need the length to be about that sort of length. You don't want it touching the table or the floor, but you don't want it to be right up here. We're basically going to be creating a circuit. So we want the electricity to be able to flow around. And at the moment, we've got insulation on here. We've got insulation on all the electrical um, wire. So we just need to strip the ends, basically. Because what we're going to do is connect that bit of garden wire onto this bit of electrical wire and have it sort of dangling down from the stand. So let's just twist that round a little bit more. I want you dangling down there. Yeah. So that way you just twist them together just like so. Now, my battery is going to be here in the circuit. And just bend up the inner part of your paper clip. Attach my magnet onto the base of the wire like clack, and have my magnet spin around rather than the wire. And we've got our battery here. So I'm just gonna tape my wires onto it. Basically, the reason it will hopefully rotate is um, if you have electricity flowing near a magnet, then, then they interact with each other and produce a force. And that force can be used to move things, just like any force. So hopefully, we're going to produce a bit of that force and rotate our magnet. So let's see if ours works. <laughs> So there you can see, oh that's brilliant, you can see that the electricity is interacting with the magnetic field, creating a force which is causing rotation, go on, go on! <laughs> now the paper clip is just so we can see that rotation really, and um, it's going pretty fast actually, especially when you get it, getting your hands steady, getting your hands steady and not catching the paper clip is the main thing to do, but that is going at a fair whack. I'd say quite conclusively that that's work. So um, that is how you make a motor. So if you want to see more videos like this, why not subscribe to Head Squeeze?